So this is me, spending about 60 minutes towards the end of the day, focusing on my cardio health, focusing on my recovery, and managing some of those aches and pains. All the while relaxing when I'm watching some of my favorite running YouTubers. This is my review of the Heat Pod Sauna Blanket by Hydrogen. Hi everybody, welcome to today's video. My name is Matt and this is What Matters to Matt. And yes, today we are gonna be talking about the Heat Pod Sauna Blanket by Hydrogun. Now I hope you enjoyed that intro. I was trying to find a way to make it a little bit interesting and show me actually using the product. And I wanted to sit down and relax and put a little bit of a nod out there for the FOD runner. Uh, one of my favorite, most inspirational YouTubers, running YouTubers out there right now. He just smashed his PB that he's been working on for a while. Probably never gonna watch this, but if you ever do, big inspiration. Thank you for that. I'll put a link to his channel in the description down below. Follow along, subscribe. You're not gonna regret it. All right, so Hydra Gun products. Now I've actually reviewed a couple of their products in the past. One of them was the Atom Mini Massage Gun. The other was the Heat Pulse Knee Massager. Both of those products I am still using quite frequently for recovery. This Heat Pod Sauna Blanket is on a whole different level for me. This kind of takes care of the whole body and we'll get into that when I get into my likes and dislikes about this product. But I do want to get a disclosure out of the way just to say that Hydragun did actually send me this product for the purpose of review. However, they are not getting the chance to see this video before I put this out on YouTube for you guys. On that note, after all is said and done and you've finished watching this video and you still think you might want to buy one of their products, this product or any of the other products that are reviewed, I'll put a link in the description to their website down below. And when you click on that link and you go to their website, when you start adding some of those products, whether it's the Adam Mini Massage Gun, the Heat Pulse Knee Massager, or this sauna blanket, you're gonna see that you're gonna get a discount on those products. I do wanna say that when you do that, I do receive a small commission on those purchases if you go through my link. That's just there to help out the channel so I'm able to keep buying probably, honestly, in a lot of cases more shoes, but keep buying more things to help me grow this channel and support this channel. It's just there for you, no pressure at all, but let's start talking about what I think about the Heat Pod Sauna Blanket. So I think it makes sense to break this up into three separate sections. First off, I wanna talk about the specs just a little bit on this product, the Heat Pod Sauna Blanket, to give you an idea of exactly, exactly what this is and what it's supposed to do. We're also gonna go into what Hydrogun says it does on the website. Some of that's a little bit sciencey, but I think probably for me, the most interesting part of the video and maybe the most interesting for you is whether I think this is actually a benefit for me. Do I actually like this product and will I continue to use it in the future? In terms of what this blanket is actually made out of, what are you gonna feel against your skin? It is a water-based vegan leather and it is sweat resistant. I know one of the questions that I had when I first got this was how is I gonna clean this? This certainly isn't something that you're able to throw in the washing machine but it does wipe down pretty easily. Now, Hydragun does say that if you're gonna be in the heat pod, you do wanna be wearing clothes, including some socks. If you do want to go naked, if you don't wanna be wearing any clothes, you can also get the towel insert. That's about $60 difference from their website if you include the towel insert. I didn't get that. I think if you had a big enough beach towel, as long as it was heat resistant, you could use that as well. But for me, usually just a pair of loose thin pants and a t-shirt or some shorts, made sure I have some socks on. Then after I get out of it, it's just really, really easy to wipe down and clean. Now, very quickly, when we look at a couple of the details of the heat pod itself, Hydrogen says that it has carbon fiber coils wound densely throughout the entire heating layer to distribute heat evenly from head to toe. And I did notice this, that there was even distribution of the heat. There are no hot spots in this blanket. They're also saying that there's a wide range of temperatures. You can select the perfect temperature setting, anywhere from 86 degrees Fahrenheit to 176 degrees Fahrenheit. That's 30 to 80 degrees Celsius for my Canadian friends. This is for maximum comfort. So a lot of wide range of heat levels to set this to and fine precision control. Now also with this, you're able to adjust it quite 
finally within one degree Celsius or two degrees Fahrenheit. And it does last for a maximum of 60 minutes. All right, now let's pop over to the Hydrogun website and have a look at what Hydrogun says this is actually going to do for you. Uh, they say it improves systemic health and recovery. Now that's cardiovascular health. It improves blood circulation, function, increases cardiac index, and decreases systemic vascular resistance. Cellular health activates heat shock proteins to help inhibit inflammation and protect cells against stress and injury. Immune system aids the body's adaptive reaction to stress by activating antioxidant protection. Now it also boosts recovery and enhances performance. Now this reduces post-workout aches, soreness, and stiffness by increasing growth hormone production. Helps the neuromuscular system recover from maximal endurance and performance. Lowers stress and increases well-being. Now this lowers cortisol levels to reduce stress and tension and improve sleep quality. Boost production of the happy hormones, dopamine, serotonin, and the endorphins to improve mood and increase well-being. All right, so we've got all that out of the way and what the product actually is. Let's talk about whether I'm actually continuing to use the product and what my likes were and maybe just a couple of little nitpicky things about it that, that I might want to change in the future. But to start off with, if you have been watching my channel, you might have noticed that I talk a lot about how I have two jobs and a family and I'm busy. But one of those jobs happens to be that I work at a local gym and at that gym, what do they have? They have a sauna. And do I use that sauna? No, because I've got the heat pod sauna blanket. It, it's this option that I have at home that's far more convenient that I can do in the evening. I can sit back and relax. And if I believe in and if I want those benefits that I feel that I get out of being in a sauna, I can get the majority of those. I'm not gonna go out there as far as to say it's exactly the same thing, but if you're talking about whether you're gonna purchase a sauna for your home, which is very, very expensive relative to this, or if you're talking about going to a gym, maybe you don't have access to a gym, or maybe you have access to a gym and you're uncomfortable being in their sauna, or you just don't want to spend the time going to the gym for the sauna, and you don't have the benefits of watching TV while you're in the sauna. So for a lot of these reasons, it just makes more sense for me to have this at home, especially since I believe that it's helping me in a lot of ways with my training and with my recovery. So how have I actually been getting along with the heat pod? Well, you have to look back at my channel just a few weeks ago. I put a video out there where I was talking quite a bit about how I was dealing with a couple of niggles, a couple of little injuries that I was a little bit worried about that were really throwing off my training. Now, what I didn't do over the next few weeks was talk about how I recovered from that. And I put out a video just the other day about a 35 kilometer long run 35 kilometers is a long way for me that went really, really well over the weekend. Why is that? Well, I had recovered from a lot of those little niggles, those little injuries that I was feeling that I was really worried about that had kind of put me on the sidelines for training for a couple of weeks. How did I do that? Well, I threw all the recovery at it that I could. And a lot of that did include the Hydra Gun products between the Atom Mini Massage Gun, the Heat Pulse Knee Massager, and this heat pod sauna blanket. I wanted to use them, all three of those items daily, making sure that I was getting as much recovery in as I could. Now you could, you could argue that when you start cleaning up your diet, you pay more attention to all of the other things, proper warm up, proper cool down, running at the appropriate paces, running at the appropriate mileage, paying more attention to all those things, that they all help. But one of the things that I also included in the mix was this sauna blanket. And I do really feel I'm a believer that it did actually help me get some of my recovery back. And I think it's helping me on a daily basis recover now as I continue to do these long runs and as I push closer and closer to that marathon that is less than four weeks away. So it honestly does come down to a couple of different things for me. When I'm using this heat pod sauna blanket, I truly believe that it is helping me with my recovery. It's helping me through some of those aches and pains from all the training, but it's also helping me with just general stress. Getting in there at night is very, very relaxing. We know that Hydragun says that to be true, and that's something that I have found. I've talked about it on my channel before, how I do struggle with my sleep, and, and it's, it's coming along, it's still not perfect, but I feel like the heat pod sauna blanket does help me relax in the evening and help me 
just wind down at the end of the day. Uh, so for all of those reasons, I, I, I'm going to continue to use this product. I'm a believer in it. Uh, if you think this is something that you would like to purchase, again, I will put a link in the description down below. Doesn't cost you any more. In fact, it's going to save you a little bit of money if you buy this product or other products from Hydrogun through that link. Remember, it does help out my channel every time that you do that. My name is Matt, and this is what matters to Matt. And ultimately, what matters to me most is my family. I'll see you guys in the next video. Ah, I almost forgot to talk about what I didn't like about the heat pod. There's nothing. It's a solid product. It does, or I think it does, what I hoped it would do. That's it. Step one, wake up, brother, gonna rise in the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, everybody just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up.